Maris, naalala pa namin yung kilig mo noong kinuwento mong magkaka-collaborate kayo ni Rico for song. Noong mga time ba na yun, masasabi mong crush mo na siya or may hope ka ba na nararamdaman for the two of you then? Paano nga ba na-develop ang feelings? Ano, i- oh. Stop ko ba muna video ko? Ano ba? <laughs> da, da. Stop! Huwag <laughs> <Okay>, makinig. <laughs> same wavelength na kayo, I guess that's uh, that's more important. Um, uy, there's a lot of firsts for this. Uh, first time ko kayong nakita together in a virtual press con. Actually, oh kanina, kanina ko lang na-realize. <laughs> diba? Oh my God. Oh. Tapos, this is the first time also na napanood ko kayo together on a frame. Like acting on a frame. Um, yeah. Rico, welcome back to acting. We miss you. <laughs> Yeah, it's good to be back. It's good to um, be part of, you know, creating in a, you know, visual and right. then acting. Uh, sarap, uh, I really, hindi ako ano, you know, I'm really, I'm not ashamed to say all oh, these years talaga, I love to act. I love wow. to act. Mm. Oh, wow. So, I'm refreshing, Rico, to see you act uh, alongside Marius, di ba? Parang, real life kilig yung dating sa amin pero yung napanood ko yung trailer kanina para sasaktan nyo kaming dalaw ng mga manonood eh. <laughs> Nako. <laughs> Abangan nyo yan. <laughs> ah, aba, ah, hindi ko alam anong pwede na yung ano. Um, <laughs> parang, parang mapapanakit ang mga episodes. I, I think it's a very relatable episode. Uh, we've I think somehow all been on either side of the yung kay Ria or yung kay Kayo, I think we've all been there. Mapapaisip ka nga minsan. Right. Mm. Makikita mo yung sarili mo doon. Okay. Mm-hmm. Ako, warm up pa lang yan. We're just warming up kasi exciting ang mga questions <laughs> ng ating mga kapamilya press. Um, I'll be reading them uh, and then um, para diretso ang sagot mula sa inyo because we don't have much time. Kaya simulan na natin. Okay, eto na. First question from Sanden Anadia from Banat News in Cebu. Um, for Rico, ano reaction mo nung nalaman mo makakasama mo sa isang acting project si Marius? Karoon ba ng pressure? Uh, pressure, siguro ang initial was, uh, siguro, if I'm gonna be honest, I was excited na, kasi I'm curious, di ba? We've, uh, it, I'm curious, like how we've always watched uh, film series together, and we're both really we're serious eh when it comes to the craft. So <laughs> nag-usap kami na mga anong tingin mo, ginawa ni Al Pacino doon, ang galing ni ano ganyan. So next side ako na okay, now we're gonna be able to work together. So yun ang isa. And in terms of pressure, siguro ano lang. Kasi medyo matagal na yung last time that I acted. So, and I know si Maris medyo hasa. And I really am a fan of her work. Objectively speaking, no, as an actress. Mm-hmm. And I tell her all the time. Kasi I'm very honest, especially the closer you are to me, I'm more honest to you. So, when she does well, I really tell her. Diba? And so, alam ko hasa siya, kumbaga. And then ako, kinakabahan ako nung start. Sabi ko, baka nagbago na. <laughs> Nagbago na ba yung language sa set? Nagbago na yung, I'm sure yung technology, nagbago na yung mga ilaw, yung mga, yung mga ganun, mga lente, mga camera. So, yun lang, dun lang MJ. Dun lang right. ako medyo na pressure. Maris, umabot sa US yung buhok mo. Natatapak. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Kaya pagupit ko lang. <laughs> <laughs> Pero grabe, parang habang nagkasalta si Rico, ako yung kinikilig para kay Maris eh. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, what, can, what can you say about that? Yung praises ni Rico for you? Well, si Rico naman, hindi naman siya BS talaga. Uh, sasabihan kanya talaga ng totoo. So I really appreciate yung sinabi niya kanina. And um, ano ko yan eh. Um, aside from myself, he's my number one critic. So... <laughs> Um, binibigyan niya ako ng mga comments and all, so I take that to heart, but um, naiintindihan ko naman yung iba pag hindi niya gusto yung gawa ko. But like, uh, I appreciate ko. Thanks for always ano, being honest. 
Right. Ako ang ganda, ang ganda. I, I can already sense na that's a beautiful uh, give and, and take relationship. She does the same for me. Really? MJ. <laughs> she does the same for me. If there's something I'm doing that I can improve. Yeah. Wow. That's nice. Ha? Very open. Okay. Uh, Maris, ang question ni Sandin for you, paano mo pinaghandaan o pinaghandaan ang proyektong ito? Okay, so siguro ang context ito is you've done a lot of projects already. Uh, parang ganito rin siguro yung tema, um, relationships and everything. How did you prepare for this as Ria? Ako as always, uh, inaaral ko po talaga yung script at inaaral ko yung character. And um, meron kasi akong usually initial na assumption sa character and um uh that kung dati pa to okay na yun. but like now i take an effort to dive deeper sa character para mas mabuhay talaga siya at mabigyan ng colors right i'm curious nangyari na ba sa sa real life na naging hopya bitter hopya ka hopya lang hindi naman siguro bitter <laughs> <laughs> but ano naman ako eh, mabilis naman ako makatanggap. Like, okay, kung itigil mo na, go. Pero, yeah, napagdaanan ka din yung mga hopya moments sa buhay. So, Paano pa, pa, nakahugot ka siguro. doon, no? Nakahugot ka doon. Ay, hugot na hugot. <laughs> ah, hugot na hugot. I love it. I love it. Thanks, Maris. And thank you to Sandian for those thank questions. You. Okay, Maris, ang question ni Michelle sa iyo is, uh, ni Kate Adahar ng Random Republica pala. Maris, naalala pa namin yung kilig mo noong kinuwento mong magkaka-collaborate kayo ni Rico for her song. Noong mga time ba na yun, masasabi mong crush mo na siya or may hope ka ba na nararamdaman for the two of you then? Paano nga ba na-develop ang feelings? Ano, i- stop ko ba muna video ko? Ano ba? Dada. Stop! Huwag kang makinig. <laughs> go, go. Well... Sa akin naman, at that time, wala naman po akong any um, assumption or kung ano mangyari. Kinilig lang ako sa fact na nakakolab ko si Rico. As Rico Blanco, yung isa sa mga um, idol ko sa OPM. And yun lang po talaga yung kilig ko. Wala na po. Anything mm-hmm. more, wala na po. You know? And the rest just happened. <laughs> Parang ganun, di ba? Oh. Something like that. Correct. Si Universe na ang uh, nag-take charge. Yeah. Diba? Okay. Rico, ang question naman ni Kate Adahar sa US, this is the perfect chance to ask this. Sabi niya, when did you realize that you have feelings for her? Wow. And how would you describe Marius as a girlfriend? Um, Rico, this is the first time we're gonna si hear Kate. you answer. Yeah. It. Oh my God. Is it? Oh, is it? Oh. Uh, ah, talaga? Sige, sige. Ah, hindi naman ako, ano eh, hindi naman ako nagtatago ng anything except, oh nga no, baka ito lang yung first opportunity. Ano, parang, parang nag, ano lang siya eh, big, nag-creep up. Like, we were trying to find out kami ni Maris some time ago, no? Kaya, how did it happen? It's parang little by little lang eh. Uh, and I think it was, I don't know. I think somewhere after our... Definitely not the first time I met her. Definitely not uh, when we were working on the song and uh, recording. Um, I take pride kasi in my professionalism in the studio, diba? No matter if I think the person I'm working with is attractive or not, diba? Or, or, or even on the set. Even uh, so when I'm doing acting or, you know, I, I take pride in my professionalism. So, wala eh. And then, I think it's it's sometime after we're done. I think when we were done working on the song. I think it was just sa mga talks namin, siguro. Yeah. Right. Ikaw na nag-text? Oh. Nag-text ka? Parang ganyan. Hey, how are you? Aga, yeah, nagkakumustahan kami. Uh, Pasensya ka na rin. Oh, DM yata. DM yata. Yeah, ah, yun na. <laughs> oh, parang ganun. Maris naman. Ito naman. Minsan lang namin makakwentuhan si Rico. Ikaw talaga. Talaga. Hindi. <laughs> Siyempre, kinikilig yung mga tao kasi nga, you know, we understand that these are private moments between the two of you, you know, but hearing some parts of it and you sharing some slices of it <laughs> makes us, ano, kilig because um, mihira namin narinig Si Rico sharing yung mga... <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> okay, okay, pero ang, ang yung part ng no, yung part ng no question ni Kate Rico is how is how you describe Maris as a girlfriend daw? I I don't like to when I say when I give siguro uh, when I siguro when I mention positive traits of Maris as a girlfriend, this is by no means uh, I'm uh, and when I'm I'm putting down naman yung mga exes ko or other girlfriends out there, no? Uh, hindi naman. Ang bawa tao naman ay may magagandang and unique traits right. and good traits about them. Ang gusto ko kay Maris, ano eh, she, may, she doesn't even realize it, but nakaka-happy eh yung vibe niya. It's, it's uh, something that's, I think, normal to them, magkakapatid. Um, because I hung out with the sisters also and the, the family and, and even with Marisa's mom and parang that's the vibe there parang barkada it, it's like same vibe when you're hanging out with you know your your friends so parang ganon and and um, it's really like that kahit kami dalawa lang of course there are days na lahat naman ng tao there are days when we're down Diba? and and happens to her happens to me too but like in general parang yung ang positive nung ano eh. so i think yung vibe it it brings out the best in me yung positive side ko nalalabas din kasi minsan nakakalimutan ko din na i'm playful pala i'm you know there's a bit of like child like yung fun in mm-hmm. every person and then she brings that out wow oh, ano siya eh. Ganda. Yon. <laughs> Hindi naman. Or let me just reverse the table. No? Maris, what can you say naman kay Rico? Para lang equal tayo. Well, <laughs> para sa akin, si Rico, um, ayaw ko, if yung presence ko to him is like um, fun, happy vibes, sa akin talaga is pahinga like security but i feel safe when he's around and that's how may kanta siyang ganyan may kanta siyang ganyan i don't know i don't know so nice but um ba but like yes uh parang um safe safe it's a safe talaga yung feeling ko pag ganyan si Rico and like feeling ko kapag any kind of problem or overthinking pag sinasabi ko sa kanya he always gives this logical reason kung bakit ko yun naramdaman and like unti-unti kong na na naiintindihan yung self ko and yung whatever I was thinking and yun like I um, gusto ko na may ganun sa buhay ko and I like to keep that around nice para kayong yin and yang Um, the sun and uh, I mean, the sky and the the sky and the sea, di ba? Parang ano kayo? Parang fit like a glove together. Parang, Thank you, MJ. Ah, yes. Thank okay. You. Thank you.